Hello, my name is Benjamin Hart. I'm an American attorney and the managing director of Integrity Legal here in Bangkok, Thailand. As the title of this video suggests, we're discussing selling a company in Thailand. And for those who set up a company in Thailand and maybe you build your business and somebody comes along and wants to buy it, there are a lot of things to consider from the seller's side with respect to, and one of the major things is extraction from liability associated with the company after the sale. You wanna make sure the formalities associated with removing oneself from the company are fully, fully flushed out. You wanna make sure that's, that's fully completed so that you don't end up in a situation where you've got a lot of liability associated with a company you're no longer associated with. Now, that may seem commonsensical, but in Thailand there are a lot of formalities, especially from a Western perspective. There are a number of formalities that are really unforeseen by your casual Westerner doing business here because honestly, Westerners can make a lot of assumptions that really aren't valid under the way the Thai legal system works. So it's definitely something to consider. I'm not saying it's necessarily an exercise in due diligence, but you definitely wanna have your own counsel when you're dealing with a sale to make sure you're fully removed from the company. I'm talking about this in kind of more of an SME context. In a merger and acquisition context, obviously, lawyers are gonna be involved because it gets very complex, but just sort of simple sale of a business, you wanna go ahead and make sure that that sale is fully formalized, so that the seller's relationship to that entity is fully severed at the time of sale.